And boom, just like magic, they're in studio with us here. Uh, joining us in studio is Runaway Angel, fresh on the heels of the release of their debut album, No End in Sight, correct? Yeah. Yeah. Sometimes you have to remember everything. Yeah. Um, and Kate and Stacy joining us this morning. Thank you for being here. Thank you Thank for you. having us. So first and foremost, congratulations on the uh, release of your album. Thank, Thank you. you. So who wants to go first in terms of what is the album all about? What is the story behind it? Is there a theme? Um, there's not really a theme, but definitely our music has a really free-spirited feeling. We're really kind of like gypsy Dixie chicks, I guess. So, Which I love. Yeah, <laughs> you, you'll definitely kind of feel that open road feeling when you listen to our record. And there is a little bit of a progression through the songs, you know, about having fun and living on the open road and a little bit of heartbreak and then some angry girl songs. So, so basically yeah. a little bit of everything. We can all relate to that. Yes. Oh, yes. I think that's fair to say. Um, it was a little bit of time in making. Yeah, um, so actually we have been sitting on this record for about a year. We were pretty much completed a year ago, and we knew as an indie band and, and a new band that we really wanted to spend time making sure that we had a fan base to deliver a record to when we finally put it out. So we sat on it, which was excruciatingly hard <laughs> for us, um, but when it did finally come out, I mean, it debuted at number five on the iTunes country charts, which was proof positive for us that waiting was very well worth it. And I think when you're talking about making sure you had a fan base, you've been nominated for a couple of awards in Ontario, so congratulations on that. Thank, Thank you. you. Yeah, this is our second year in the row that we've been nominated for four CMAO awards. So, uh, songwriters, al al not album, single of the year. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we didn't have an album. What am I talking yeah. about? Yeah. Next year, maybe. <laughs> Next year, <yeah. laughs> and for a music video as well. So you ladies have been very busy. You've also been... Uh, placed or cast, I don't know what the right word is, in the top six for the CCMA Discovery Program Award? Yeah. yeah. What's that all about? Actually, the, C the CCMA, it's, it's the Canadian Country Music Association, actually, mm -hmm. they, oh, yeah. <laughs> they're, one of their mandates is to help to really develop and encourage Canadian country music and Canadian country content. So they're doing a fabulous job. They put together this program. This is in the fourth year, and we're, we were just overjoyed to be a part of the top six, and they brought us to Toronto, and they, it was an intensive week of training. So we'd wake up really early. We, we went to Twitter building, went to Instagram. Wow. We learned about booking. We learned about all sorts of stuff, and it was really great. Certainly something you want to have under your belt when you're, yeah. uh, when you're starting out. In uh, Canada especially, country music, we see it a lot more popular than other yes. genres of music. How are you finding it? How are you finding... Uh, taking the reins of the country music and going and in, in It's Canada. exciting right now. I mean, I think everyone is just upping their game. Like, the music is amazing right now. What people are producing is amazing, and the writing is really good. So it's just an exciting time to be a part of all of the stuff that's happening. It's becoming more popular. Like you said, there's more state radio stations popping up, more festivals. So there's definitely, like, a big thing happening. Well, we are super excited to have you here. You were going to perform your single June for us. What's June about? Well, June is kind of about, you know, when I guess you have that summer love and, you know, maybe winter comes along and you're kind of feeling like, you know, summer breakups, right? So you break up at the end of the summer and the winter comes and you're still feeling like that heat of the summer, but the hurt of the winter. Again, relatable. So <laughs> I'm going to walk off stage and let you take it away real quick, though. If people want to get to know more of you, see where you're going, what you're up to, where can they where can they find you? Uh, our website is runawayangelmusic.com, and we're very uh, averse in the social media world, so you can Obviously. literally find us on every platform humanly possible, including <laughs> Snapchat. Sounds good. And it's Runaway Angel. No S at the end. Runaway yeah. Angel, just to make sure. I'm going to clear the stage, let you ladies take it away. Thank you again for being here this morning, Thanks. and congratulations again. Thank, Thank you, you so much, much for having us. <laughs> Like a sun in a reckless sky, I thought that shine would go away, go away. Guess you should've known it then. Everything comes to an end, but I keep playing over and over. My soul is changed. It shouldn't feel this way. The season should be changing, changing. June, I feel you in my bones. You sent me. You be so calm, the chill of your goodbye, the cool in your eyes. Oh, won't you? Oh, won't you? Oh. When the snow fell to the ground and it all came tumbling down, somehow your wheels kept turning and 
turning But you took your love away Now nothing's gonna be the same You said this could never happen Happen My soul is changed It shouldn't feel this way The season should be changing Changing June, I feel you in my bones You set me on fire Took away the light Oh, June, how could you be so calm? The chill of your goodbye The cool in your eyes Oh, June, won't you let me go? you